Welcome to Jeff Rowe's Wide World of Sport Aviation. Here comes the aviator himself. Hey, Jeff Rowe. Good morning, folks. Today, I'm going to down, go down and visit my sister and we are delivering attitude. Sister Heather is short, but she's feisty. And uh, I don't know how many times I've heard her say, I don't give a rat's ass, or nobody gives a rat's ass. So when I was down in Florida this February, and I saw this shirt, and I had her name all over it. We're gonna fly down and deliver this attitude to my sister, who doesn't need the attitude, but this should suit her just fine. Hey, Patrick, Fox out to you, Whiskey Whiskey is rolling to it, Carp. And the Mazda rotary hums its way into the air. Taking off at a carp on our way to Over Smith Falls to Brockville. Changing course here, turning southbound. These puffy little clouds are hard to see from the ground, but they're kind of neat to see. I just like this section here going through the little clouds. It's a fun thing to do in the airplane. Now coming over top of the Smith Falls Airport, CYSH, my old alma mater, and then on, on to and over the Rideau River. And before long, there's Brockville Airport's in sight. Now this is not one of my better landings here. I'm not quite lined up at the runway. I'm coming in at about a 15 degree angle. I hit an area where there's heavy, a lot of sinking air, so I have to give it the throttle hold it till I'm almost over the threshold to uh, stop from meeting the ground too early. This makes me come in a little a little hot, but I'm also a little bit low. Anyway, with the gusty winds, it was uh, I was fighting the airplane a little bit here to, to get it under control. Make a pretty smooth landing, but It looks like the airplane bounces here, but it doesn't. I catch it just in time with the throttle and put it back down. That was a smooth but crazy landing. Out of gust. I will show it here again from the uh, from the dash cam view. You know, notice that the. Uh, the horizon pretty much goes out of sight here as I pull the nose up at the last second before it drops onto the runway right there. Anyway, all's well that ends well. We park it there. Hey. Cut her down and Sister Heather was waiting. She drove us to the infamous restaurant at Tin Cap where I presented her don't 
give a rat's ass t-shirt before we all dine down some bacon eggs and home fries and then before you know it we were back on the plane and on our way home here I do a circle on the ramp to make sure there's no airplanes in the sky above me and listen to the radio taxiing down to the threshold of the runway Traffic, traffic, uh, fuck that too, whiskey, whiskey, we're taking position on runway 22 for immediate takeoff we're going to make a uh, climbing turnout right hand turnout to the north Before you know it, about 10 minutes later, we're over the town of Smith Falls. You can see it here under the nose and a little bit to the left. On the way down, we overflew the airport. On this trip home, we're flying over the town site itself. And in another 10 minutes or so, we're back in the circuit at Carp. You can see the airport off to the left, that long thin line there of pavement, that's the airfield coming in on final this is a better landing, smoother, better approach my only, my main critique for myself on this one is I'm a little off the center I put it down with the right wheel on the on the center line, I should, I should be having the nose of the airplane right on the center line I'll have to work at that But again, all's well, it ends well. Good landing, even though I'm a little bit off the center. I'll work at uh, that. We'll see how it goes in the next, in some of my next videos. Anyway, we're down home, safe and sound, on the taxiway, headed back to the hangar. Pulling into home sweet home. Until next time, thanks for watching.